Okay, so hello everyone. Uh, today we're going to be presenting our presentation on the undergraduate transition to LSE and how improvement could be made to the social transition, specifically using a family system. So first, just a little bit about us. Uh, me and Natalia actually met at a Changemakers event uh, in first term in 2018 in Michaelmas, and we immediately connected over our mutual experience of first term. We, we talked about how we'd both found our first time at LSE incredibly overwhelming, the amount of information you get and just the experience as a whole, we found that we both felt incredibly overwhelmed with the entire experience, but also a lack of sort of guidance. And we were both unsure where to look when we had those moments of overwhelm. Specifically, we found that we didn't quite have second year students to look up to or people on our course to talk to when we found that we had become overwhelmed with work or we didn't know what we were doing. And while systems did exist, they were often piecemeal systems that differed across different departments. And we often felt like there was a kind of, a lot of them were a little bit ineffective and there was nothing very concrete that we could reach out to when we needed that help. I don't know, Natalia, if you wanted to speak briefly about your experience in first term as well. Yeah, so as an international student, I had no idea about how to even live in London. I didn't know what to do. I had to go to random coffee shops of LSE being like, can you help me with my homework? So it was horrible and I really wanted like someone just casual that I could talk to. So we came up with the idea of, well, implementing a family system at LSE. So yeah and i had a similar experience of feeling really stuck and the main thing that helped me in that first term was reaching out to a sort of befriended older student to get help with academia and just get some reassurance because the whole experience was so overwhelming and so the main point is we came together because we both found that first term really overwhelming and we'd kind of felt animated to do this project and think about how first year students could be better connected to an older student in that transition uh, one thing to mention is that we've actually been working on this project for two years. Uh, we started in Michaelmas term of 2018 and I was ill for a while so we actually had to put the project on pause but we've been working on this project for about two years so we're incredibly excited to finally bring anything, everything together. Um, going, moving on to our literature review, uh, we examined quite a big amount of data given that we've been working on it for a while. Um, we looked at a lot of studies and literature about the plethora of difficulties and challenges associated with the undergraduate transition and also studies around the effectiveness of family systems which clearly indicated their strength in easing the experience for new undergraduates. Um, we observed just from our observations there was various peer orientated pastoral systems at LSE but there was no clear sort of university-wide system that everyone got access to. It was kind of piecemeal across different departments. Um, we'll look into this more in a little bit of time. Um, we also looked at other top UK universities such as Oxbridge and Durham who we noted do have university-wide family systems which operate on this very sort of holistic basis where students are placed in nuclear family groups with older students on their course or within their accommodation who then the older students then give them parental support throughout their first term and we saw that these reports were all very positive and there was a lot of praise given to how much support these family groups actually give. In addition, we also looked at the mental health report conducted by the LSESU in 2018. It should come as no surprise that they reported this. Um, there's a lack of, uh, the culture kind of lacks peer support and collaboration amongst students. Nearly half of the 500 respondents said that they felt isolated due to a lack of university-wide community. And this coupled with a sort of academic, uh, competitive academic culture really creates a toxic environment. So the first thing that we did is we conducted a survey with first year students because we wanted to dig deeper about the existing access to pastoral, so peer pastoral support and first year's relationships with second year students. So in January, we conducted a survey with first year undergraduates with 114 respondents. Our survey showed that 78% agreed that Michaelmas term was overwhelming for them, yet 60% of respondents had made uh, had made use of pastoral support systems either only once or never and as you can see that disparity kind of raises some questions about why students aren't reaching out for pastoral support when we asked students why 70 percent said that they did not access because they believed they didn't have specific questions and 63 percent believed that their issues were not serious enough to access the support so clearly there's a sort of barrier to students reaching out for that help because they feel like there are, you know, they don't feel like their issues are serious enough or they just want general reassurance rather than have specific questions to bring. 
We also then asked if students would have benefited from pastoral support with an older student. 70% of respondents indicated they would have benefited from a connection with an older student. And amazingly, 98% who had sought support from an older student with whom they had a connection had found it helpful. So bringing all of this together, we kind of looked at our literature review along with our survey, which showed these deficiencies in the amount of support that students were accessing. And we kind of pieced it all together and thought that a family system might be a really good way to tie this all together and alleviate this problem of first year students feeling overwhelmed and feeling a bit isolated and feeling unable to reach out to that help, especially where they didn't have specific questions, but they just felt generally quite overwhelmed with the whole experience. So this brings us to the main bulk of our um, research, which we did, which was conducting a pilot study. So in Michaelmas term uh, in 2019, so this last year, we conducted a pilot study over the first 11 weeks of Michaelmas term and recruited two first year students to whom we were parents and they were our children. Uh, we operated in a nuclear family and arranged weekly lunch meetings of an hour long from week one all the way to week 11. We had some gaps in the middle. We did about probably about eight sessions um, and we were matched uh, diagonally. So one of the children we were matched with on our course subject and the other we were matched with on our halls accommodation so we had stuff in common both ways um, the focus of these sessions was just to be a listening ear to these students every week we'd meet for lunch so it would fit neatly in their schedule and we talk about whatever they wanted to talk about really we just say how's your week going how are you finding the experience you know how's how's uh, academia how's your friends how are you finding the whole experience and just being there to the to them to kind of reassure them and help them out listen to their experiences relate to their experiences and give them our best advice and just sort of support them uh, we also were very insistent on having a parent child dynamic so we called them the children and we were the parents and kind of having that sort of those names created this fam family dynamic of us being the mums and it was yeah so that was the kind of parental setup uh, the results, our findings from that pilot study were, and it brought us a lot of joy to conduct it and our findings were kind of three things came out of the pilot study. The first is that we observed both from ourselves and from their feedback that it was incredibly helpful to them. In that first term, they had so many questions in those first few weeks and they were honestly like you could just see how confusing that experience was. Um, and every week they bought just a multitude of different topics and questions and things that they didn't understand or things that they just needed reassurance or a bit of help with. And every week we were able to support them with just like such a range of issues that they were facing. Sorry. Um, yeah, our recommendations are that we roll out a university wide family system with um, increasingly large pilot study groups each year into it so we can embed uh, this new university wide family system into the LSE undergraduate. Um, community and alleviate uh, the toxic competitive culture and enhance a more collaborative and supportive student community at LSE.